again. My name is Gabe Zona. This is the 17th of January 2019. I just spent the last bit of time looking at a series of videos. I've attached four links. And the title of this video that I'm about to make is Open with Caution Organ Harvesting Videos. And you're going to hear and see things that you probably don't want to hear and see. You might want to avoid opening any of these videos. You're going to hear what goes on in China where they take the organs from people that are not anesthetized. They're totally awake. And they remove their corneas, they remove their livers, their kidneys, their hearts, and their lungs. And the reason they do it without any kind of medication is because the organ is more valuable if it's fresh and if there's no medication that's been introduced into the body. You're going to hear how the Chinese go after certain groups of people that are known to be more careful with their bodies. They don't drink, they don't do drugs, so they're considered to be more valuable. The Falun Gong practitioners, and they do it to Christians. I'm sure they do it to Jews. This is going on in China. I remember doing videos in Syria and they had Syrian slaughterhouses where they were slaughtering people for food. The women and children got the organs, the brains. The warriors got the fleshy parts of the bodies. And that's where they were experiencing a, a rash of Kuru disease, which you can only get from eating human organs. You can't make this stuff up, folks. I remember doing a video a few years ago where a woman received a letter from her brother. He was shot in the leg. He was taken to a hospital in Syria. She went to visit him and she was told that he died. When they looked at the body, his chest had been opened. They removed his organs. And again, he was shot in the leg. In one of these videos, you're going to hear how thousands of prisoners, Syrian prisoners that were captured by Syria, are have their organs harvested. You're going to hear about a black man that was shot here in the United States and his organs were harvested. And they replaced his organs with newspaper, stuffed newspaper inside his body to fill the void. Folks, you can't make this stuff up. You're going to learn that there was over 30,000 operations last year of organ transplants. Where are they getting all these organs from? You ever wonder where Dick Cheney got his heart? Huh? You ever wonder how he got to the front of the line to get a heart? <laughs> all it takes is money. And Dick Cheney had an awful lot of money, which he still does have. Folks, you might not want to open up those links. And one of them you're going to see a little girl, maybe three or four years old, and they take her organs while she's still alive. These people 
are sick. We should have nothing to do with Syria. We should have nothing to do with Saudi Arabia, who practice Sharia law and abide by the letter of the Quran. We should have nothing to do with many members in our government that are involved in these kinds of activities. Take a look at them, but you've been warned. I'm being deadly serious. You have been warned. And watching these videos is at your own peril or at your own risk. You're probably not going to sleep well if you watch the videos. Not for a while. I'll attach the links. Choice is yours. You might want to repost this in all your social media accounts. You might want to pass along to like-minded friends and ask them to do the same. And then again, you might just want to delete this video. Thanks for listening.